Today we will learn about seeds. Some seeds can be eaten while some seeds cannot be eaten by us. Today we are going to learn something about seeds. The seeds which you see in this picture are edible seeds. Edible seeds are those seeds which can be eaten by us. Children, these are some parts of the plant that we eat like cucumber, watermelon, chili, mango, pumpkin and tomato. These parts of a plant hold the seeds. They store seeds inside them. So they are called the fruits of the plant. The other parts of the plant like leaves, stem and roots do not hold any seed. So they are considered as the vegetables. Seeds vary in texture, shape and size. Few seeds such as mango and lemon have big and small seeds. The texture of some seeds is very hard and rough and some seeds have a different shape. Most of the seeds are in different shapes, sizes, texture and color. Some seeds like peanuts and sesame can be eaten raw. Some seeds like Bengal gram, kidney beans, rice, corn, and pulses need to be cooked before eating. We cannot eat these seeds raw because they are hard and difficult to digest. Can you see the picture of fruits here? These are the parts of a plant which carries seeds. They protect the seeds of the plant. Flowers of a plant grow into fruits and fruits stores the seed inside them. And the seeds inside the fruit have a baby plant hidden in them. Let us find out more about seeds and let's see its structure. Look at the seed children. This green part of the seed is called the seed coat. It is the outer covering of the seed. When we soak these seeds in water, the covering of the seed comes out easily and you can see the inside part of the seed. This is the seed coat children and it protects the seed. This is the cotyledon children. It stores food for the tiny baby plant until the plant after growing out from the seed is able to produce its food by its own. Before it is a seed, the cotyledons produces food to nourish the seed and the baby plant inside it. This is a bean seed children, a kidney bean and it has two parts, two cotyledons or they are also known as seed leaves. All the seeds do not have two cotyledons. Some seeds like kidney beans, peas, Bengal gram have two cotyledons and some seeds like corn have one cotyledon. The seed carries a baby plant inside it. 
you can see the baby shoot here and the baby root here these are the leaves of the baby plant and this is the root which will grow downwards into the soil let's revise the structure of a seed a seed stores food for the baby plant it carries a baby plant inside it it is also called embryo the outer covering which protects the seed is called the seed coat and the two cotyledons provide and stores food for the baby plant the seeds sprout sprout means the seed grows a plant out of it when they get water air and warm place to grow from the sprout grows a baby plant the baby plant at first is not able to prepare food by its leaves so from the cotyledons it is going to take the nourishment and food for its growth